Speaking of busy, a busy ski weekend on tap in the Sierra tonight. Thousands are expected to turn out to enjoy the feet of snow during last weekend's monster storm. Yeah, they sure have a lot of it now. CBS 13's Andrew Hobner is live at Boreal with a look at the crowds and the conditions. Andrew? That's golden hour, guys. I got a real tough job out of here, but uh, maybe not as tough as it is for the locals that have spent the better part of this week tracking out Boreal and the rest of Palisades and Alpine Meadows. They're ready for crowds to come on mass starting this weekend, but they've gotten some good days in after this blizzard, and they're ready to share the wealth now. It's all smiles in the Boreal parking lot. The vibes are great. It's a great day. It was a little icy yesterday. Everything softened up. It's great. The park's ripping. Yeah. It's nice. a good yep. day. Agreed. <laughs> Gus Marantos and Tanner Caton are locals up here and are catching some laps before the crowds come. We're worried about the, hopefully people just drive safe, you know. But yeah, yeah and then the, everything's going to be busy, but that's okay. No big deal. The two managed to find some leftover powder as winds blew most of the good stuff off the mountains. It's tracked out pretty quick, like the main runs and stuff, but it's a smaller mountain, especially here at Boreal. But yeah. yeah, you can always find if you know what you're doing. On the other side of the pass at Alpine Meadows, a lift closure actually kept the crowds away. Because of the power outage, everybody went over to the other mountain. There was a mass exodus. While those coming from Palisades said the conditions were pretty good. Wolverine Bowl is really nice. Um, and then Tower 16 over uh, at um, Palisades is really good as well. After all, when it's a bluebird day with good snow, really be in a bad mood. At least it was sunny mm -hmm. and it was warm. So I was like, okay, yeah, just chill. And all that extra snow is helping out some of the local mountains here, too. Sugar Bowl is going to stay open a little bit longer. Their closed date now scheduled for April 28th. We talked to our buddy Tucker here at Boreal about whether or not they had an end date that was going to get pushed. They said not as of right now because they still have mountain bike trails that they got to contend with once the season kind of comes. But, I mean, this is spring skiing vibes today. We've had people out in T-shirts and bluebird days and sure feels like March in the Sierra now, guys. Yeah. It's going to be ripping for a while. <laughs> ripping indeed. I bet you people from Ripping are even there. <laughs> Made the drive. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, Andrew.